the, the overall goal is to increase the social uh, inclusion of persons affected with the sensory disabilities. So with a specific focus on visual impairment and hearing impairment. And what we do, uh, first we study this kind of impairment, which effect they have on, uh, on, on the society. Basically, um, these people are at risk of exclusion because for visual impairment, uh, there exists not today a technology which allows uh, blind children to learn mathematics to use a scientific content and this has a huge impact on autonomy, uh, mobility and um, their future uh, career. For hearing impairment, uh, instead, uh, there is a huge issue in communication problems. When people have acoustic prosthesis in their ears, uh, that's fine, but it's not enough because in crowded places it's still a big issue. So we propose a technology to really improve them. The devices that we develop for visual impaired persons are tested within rehabilitation centers. So those uh, uh, centers are centers where, where there are persons who are very expert in how to improve uh, uh, step by step, day by day, the quality of life. They tell us if we're going in the right direction and there might be our first uh, customers, for example. Our, our technologies might be used uh, in everyday rehabilitation practices. Um, and concerning hearing impairment as well, as I said, we work with, uh, uh, with companies, so they know what is going to uh, be successful in the market one day. If, uh, if something is wrong, they tell us from, from the beginning. And uh, last but not least, everything that we do might, be, um, might decrease the cost of health services, because any device which improves the quality of life dramatically reduces the cost for uh, of the welfare uh, systems. So for a small expense in low cost devices causes a big money saving for the state. Uh, so our research goal uh, is very well defined, is increasing social in inclusion, which is a big societal challenge. We do it in a peculiar way. Uh, first, our technologies are uh, easy to use. Second, they are low cost. And third and most important, they increase uh, uh, independence and quality of life and increasing independence uh, for people who have uh, issues like uh, uh, sensory losses means to give back uh, uh, their dignity.